while I'm waiting. Bro. I just felt like filming today. So I'm gonna go to United to get stuff for dinner. Y'all are gonna cook with me. What the fuck is the dur truck? We'll see what else we get into while we're out. I'm gonna just get this chicken. Got the chicken. Balloon for Zoe and a little snack for Zoe. I look like a fucking wreck. Literally right around the corner. So I don't really know why I'm putting on music, but. Hey everyone, it's Anna. I'm making chicken and rice. I need to gather three main ingredients. Chicken, rice, and tomato sauce. Go ahead and start off by dicing the chicken. I do my little dancey dance. I hate the word meat. It's grody. I don't really care how my chicken looks um, when I'm making chicken and rice because I'm just gonna shred it anyways at the end. If I didn't like the way meat tasted, just keep on dancing like a freak, ho. Uh, rewind that. If I didn't like the way chicken st and steak and pork tasted, I would 100% be a vegetarian. Let me explain myself. So I love the taste of these different things. I just am grossed out by the fact that this is an animal. It's hard for me to believe that this right here is like the little animals like walking around on farms and shit. I hate touching raw meat. This is why I don't like to cook because I don't like touching meat. Maybe in a different universe, I'm a vegetarian for sure. Or in a past life, I'm a vegetarian. Okay, so now that I have the chicken diced, I'm gonna heat the pan up with vegetable oil and season it. Oh my God, what is that? And for our seasonings, I'm just gonna do onion powder, garlic powder, fajita seasoning, ground camino, and chicken bouillon. Come closer. Okay, here we go, ladies. I'm honestly like a lazy piece of shit, and this meal probably takes like 20 minutes to cook, but I think my pan is hot enough. Chicken is in the pan. I'm gonna go ahead and add some more seasoning. It looks like it needs a little bit more, so I'm gonna add a tad bit more of everything that we just put in. So I'm using a one-third cup to put my rice in the pan. One, two. I'm a boss, I do it. While I'm waiting on the food to be done, I'm gonna show you all my best. Fortnite emotes. You really thought you ate? I have done quite a bit of shopping on Depop and I have some really good pieces so I didn't want to make a whole video on it because I'm sure y'all don't want to hear me yap about like 10 pieces that I've gotten. First, I actually thrifted this from my good. <laughs> it's an Adidas kind of oversized tee. Very cute. It's kind of faded, but I like it like that. So found this from my Goodwill. Um, this is a Tommy Hilfiger like vest thing. I'm not really sure what you'd call it, but it's it fits me good. I like the oversized fitting. It's just this, the armpit hangs too low so I'm gonna see if my grandma can hem it for me. It's my first thing that I depopped or that I got off depop. It's this cute off the shoulder BB shirt. I also got these low rise jeans off depop. Now these are vintage. Um, the back is so cute. I love them. This is the most recent one that's came in. It is a Harley shirt. Oh my god. It has a stain on it. That's okay. It looks like deodorant but next I got this Gap halter top it's so cute now it's a baby blue with these baby blue diamonds all over 
and this is what I'm pairing it with. These are a gap as well. Baby pink. I wanted to show y'all this that I got from my mother-in-law as well. It's another halter top, but it's hot pink. If y'all haven't noticed, I'm trying to find my style. I like where I'm going with this. I like that it's all used. Just had to do a little intermission before I continued with my night routine. I was gonna do an everything shower, but I'm getting my hair done tomorrow and it doesn't need to be washed. So I'm just gonna put it up in a bun. It's 9.30 right now, but I am gonna shave my legs so I can feel good about myself. Just gonna put my hair up really quick, but I just twist my hair up. My hair is so ridiculously long. That's why I'm excited to get my hair done. I'm not gonna tell y'all what I'm doing yet. That's for the next video. Oh my God, my forehead looks huge. So here is my nighttime routine. Hopefully it's not too echoey, but I just got out. I didn't wanna bring y'all for my actual shower because I don't want you creeps and weirdos to be weird. So I'm just going to talk about the products that I use while I take my shower. I'm just going to take a little bit of this. I don't normally use shaving oil, but this stuff is amazing and it smells delicious. Um, I just use regular Dove shampoo and conditioner, the coconut one specifically. Um, I don't really have too much of a hair care routine, obviously. But... For my body, I use I use this Exfoliate Away Dove body wash. And then after I use that, I use a Smell Good body wash from Bath & Body Works. Anything vanilla is my favorite, um, but this is just the Vanilla Bean Noel. I also just wanted to take the time to say that I normally wouldn't be shaving my legs after I get out of the shower. Normally, like every other girl in the world, I would do it while I'm in the shower with water and soap just wanted to sit down and talk with y'all and do things a little differently for an evening in the life of a fancy famous youtuber as i am obviously and then i also wash my face in the shower so the two face washes that i've been using the bubble fresh start gel cleanser and for my oil-based one i use the glossier or glossier milk jelly cleanser Quick story time while I finish doing my hair. So I also do UGC content, which is just when I create content like TikToks, Reels, just pictures, like really anything for a brand. And then I send it to them and they post it on their account instead of me posting it on my account. I signed a contract for um, to do three UGC photos for $500. Went to look over the email just so I knew what I needed to exactly do as far as content goes because I received the product. This brand's website is gone, their Instagram is gone, everything is just gone, poof, gone. So I really don't know what to do. I emailed them like a week ago as soon as I got the product. I haven't heard from them still. Should I look forward into this? Should I just forget it? I mean, I don't, I don't know what to do. Y'all comment below and let me know what I should do. But other than brushing my teeth, that's pretty much everything. Um, thanks for listening to my rant about my brand deal. But thank you for watching my nonsense. I can't wait to see you baddies again. Jumped in the cab, here I am for the first time. To my right and I see the Hollywood sign.